Take us back to, I'm going to say 2010, you know, Tuka at this time, he's in school. Take us through them days. How was Tuka at that time? Uh, hmm. I can take you back to when we first moved around on St. Lawrence, where they named the block and the gang after him. Like, when we first moved over there, it was, you know, it wasn't all peaches and cream. Uh, he would walk to school to get on the bus. I would walk him to school, well, to the bus stop. Every day? Yes, before I go to work, because my bus base was right around the corner from the house, so I made sure him and his little sister got on the bus. And uh, I'd go my way and go on to work. And... Uh, I remember one day we standing on the bus stop <laughs> and the little boy inside the parkway was standing behind the gate talking smack to my son. So I'm looking at him, I'm like, first of all, you have no respect for me standing here as his mother. Why are you talking about what you're going to do to him and stuff like that? So, so wait, 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 not to cut you off. You were there when you seen this? Uh, Yeah. When the boy approached him, yes, I was at the bus stop with my son. Like, I was a pretty much hands-on, no matter my job. I was a pretty much hands-on mom with my kids. Because like I say, I was a single mother, and I was all they had besides my grandmother. 